So this is a quick video. Um, I'm just trying to show some of the weird shit I've been going through with uh, Vegas Pro and how to fix it. So when you first drop a video into your line, you you don't usually see it looking how you originally recorded it. Um, and to fix that, we will take a quick run through. So here's what it'll look like when you first drop it in. And I did some tests Every couple weeks I go through and make test videos to try to figure out how the hell I can fix the coloring. And you can see I've messed with the saturation a bit and I rendered out what it looks like here in test one, test two, and it still didn't match the original, this guy. So this is a raw video. So obviously they don't match. So after dinking around and you obviously can change the levels and it, it never really, to me, it never looked as good as the original when you go like that. So you can see that the saturation and colors are still off a bit from the original. And I, I never could figure out how to exactly fix that until now. So get rid of this shit. We don't need it anymore. This is what it looks like. Drag and dropped into it. For some reason, the default setting I had, I don't know if I did it or it was just like that when I installed, um, but if you click here, Project Properties, and this basically is what will automatically apply to your video. And if you just turn this off right here, View Transform, turn that off, Apply, boom. And just like that, it'll automatically keep your raw video coloring, saturation, contrast, brightness, all that kind of shit will automatically just stay as if it was the raw video was just dropped in, which is what it should do. And there you go. It kind of fixes it. And you no longer have to, to change the Sony levels for every video, tweak with saturation and contrast, brightness or whatever, try to match the original, which is what I was doing before. Um, and just got to render this out, and it should look like what it previews as. Might still need to twix, tweak some levels, but there you go. I mean, I think this is going to fix all the issues, and hopefully it fixes your issues by simply unchecking that. Well, not unchecking the box, but changing it. Um, and make sure your pixel format is not 8-bit and not video levels, but full range. That is also another issue that will screw up things. So there you go. Hope that fixed your problem. Peace.